Hi there. When you are choosing a course to take with Udemy, I know it's very important that you have a good description of the course so that you know or have an, a good idea of what are you going to get from the course and what is the course going to teach me. And so I think it's important to kind of briefly go over our course description so that you can have a really good, maybe some more specifics that will help you in terms of deciding whether or not you want to take this course. Um, so let's take a look at that and then maybe you know I can help you in terms of making your decision. Uh, this course will really go through a lot of the practice exams and review strategy step by step from the instructor, which is, which is of course me. Um, so we're actually going to go through practice exams and practice tests. And I think that's something that's very important because by doing that, you're going to be able to get a good idea and learn specifically how to do the exam. So you're going to get all the necessary skills in this course to be able to perform well actually on the exam itself. In terms of the reading course, we're going to teach you really how to locate, how to locate the information by skimming and scanning. The most important thing that a student has to learn for the reading section is how to scan for the matching sentences because that's what they really are testing here. It's really not reading comprehension, okay? It's really not reading comprehension. They're not asking you to read the whole passage and then be able to answer the questions. You have to be able to learn how to scan for specific information. Also, there are techniques and strategies for each question type. And I want, we're going to show you how to do that. How to be able to apply the right techniques and strategies for each question type. Understanding synonyms and how synonyms relate in the reading passages is very, very important. And so we're going to go over those things for you so that you really understand how to do reading. For most students, once I teach them the proper strategy and tactics for the reading section, they get it. And then they understand. And then they can perform very well. In terms of listening, we're going to teach you how to predict. How to predict your answers. How to analyze and understand when an answer is being said. That's so important for the IELTS exam in terms of listening. How do you know when they're saying the answer itself? And I'm going to teach you that. I'm going to instruct you on how to know when they're saying the answer. So that's very, very important that you learn how to do that. In terms of the writing section, wow, as you know, we have two tasks here. So we're going to focus on teaching you how to really understand that visual information for task number one and how to really interpret the data and, and statistics. And what's even more important is for task number one, there is one writing structure that you need to do any of the types of graphs or, or charts. One writing structure. And we're going to teach you that writing structure that you need to know. For task number one, you only need to do about nine to ten sentences. That's all. But you have to know what is the proper structure for doing it right. In terms of task number two, we're going to be teaching you how to structure and organize the essay properly for the IELTS exam. Okay? Remember, it's a timed exam. And so we're teaching you how to properly organize an IELTS essay. Some of the things you learned in ESL school and other and, 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 and normal school, they don't necessarily apply here because of the time factor. So we're going to teach you how to write the IELTS task to essay. And finally, in terms of speaking, doing well on the speaking section is all about understanding what type of answer is the grader expecting from me? What type of answer are they expecting? You're not just sitting there answering questions. We're going to teach you how to organize your notes for part two properly so that you can give an organized response. We're going to help you with, with being able to communicate your ideas clearly. Okay, If you can speak clearly, fluently, and be able to show that you have a, 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 have a, have a range in your speaking ability, we're going to be able to help you get that great score. So, that's just a little bit of a description about when you take our course um, and what you're going to receive by doing it. So, 
I hope to see you soon. It will be my honor to be your teacher. And thank you very much. And I look forward to seeing you soon. Bye.